Hey, what's up everybody? It's Mike Mackey. Welcome to another episode of my vlog here on my channel. In today's episode, we're going to cover the two events that I did uh, this past week. Um, the first one was the Two Mech Show. Two Mech! Two Mech! Two Mech! It was at uh, La Santa. It was so dope. AWOL won the legendary Mark Love, LMNO, the Visionaries. I got some footage for you guys to check out. So here, take a look. It was so dope seeing cool artists like AWOL1, Gel Rock, uh, meeting a lot of cool people. All uh, everyone from out the house. It was such a cool event. And, um, you know, I have nothing but like fond memories of that. It was such a cool place. And um, I had so much fun. It was really cool. Um, just kind of like being absorbed into the vibe, you know. Um, I got some more footage for you guys. So uh, here, check it out. I don't want you people to just stand there, but I do want you to do is yell like you don't care. They don't. Right. They really don't. Yeah, rally round. Feel the sound. Pulled up to the party like a washed up celebrity. Waiting for the homie to get back from a beer run. Push the circle into a square. Shape shifters, but nobody cares. Drunken vandals playing sublime records while the groupies always have you. Yeah, that's pretty dope. Seeing artists like AWOL1 was so cool, man. Like, he was had such a great stage presence, and um, it really made me a fan that night. Um, you know, I've been a fan, but, like, it really solidified it. Um, just to watch him play live like that, and, you know, just to see his crowd control and the reception that he got from the audience was, was great. Uh, but I got some more footage here. Um, here, check a look. Like the West Coast gangster rap from Dog Pound to the DJ Quicks, even the newer stuff like Kendrick Lamar and all of them. But it comes back to the originator and it comes back to the person that had a fucking This was one of the first headliners that I ever booked. Ever. In a 60, in a 60 capacity bar in Palapachanga in Santa Ana, in City by the manager. See, it was only right for me to do my first show back from pandemic after doing 15, 15 years of shows every month, non-stop, but I had to come back to this, and I had to bring it back to my brother. I had to bring it back to my brother, too much, so make some other fucking noise. Yo, 
yo, check, check, can you hear me? Make some motherfucking noise. Huh? perform the way he did um, was so inspiring to me as an artist and as a person I've been to thousands of shows my whole life and um, seeing this kind of intimate performance with an artist like Tumex um, I was just thoroughly blown away to see an artist like Tumex perform the way he did um, it made me forever a fan. Um, the, the guy is a bona fide rock star, and um, I think you know, especially as an artist, um, that was one of the things that I took away from that. Uh, just having such a relationship with an audience and your supporters, um, it was a beautiful evening. I, I really, it's hard to put it into words because. Um, the energy that night was just life-changing. By far one of the best, if not the best performances I've ever seen from an artist. And um, I was really fortunate to be there in such a capacity. I was on stage, um, you know, to be on the other side of the, the rope, so to say, um, it was such an amazing experience that I'll never forget. I had some other events this week that uh, the homies at the Casbah, the SD State of Mind crew, were putting a uh, album release party and they had a host of um, artists come out and show some love. SD State of Mind and Hip Hop Wes really hold a special place in my heart. You know, it was one of the first places that I really started to play and that I got a really good reception from. 
Um, and, you know, I, I love all those guys. They're, you know, it's one extended family out here in San Diego. And um, it was cool to see everyone, you know, after a long duration, especially with uh, the COVID closures of certain venues and things. So, and I have some more footage for you guys to check out. So, here, check this out. Sham Black, man, he was putting it down. Uh, it was really cool to see a lot of my homies and stuff. And, you know, um, had some really cool footage. Um, big shout out to Kali and everyone at SD State of Mind. Um, that was just, it was just a really, really cool event. And, um, you know, it was a really good night for local San Diego hip hop. And uh, I was just, you know, I was so fortunate to be there. And um, it was cool just seeing all my homies and, uh, it was cool. So uh, here I got some more footage for you guys. If you want to check it out? Yeah, check this out. <laughs> such an amazing evening it was nothing but love and um yeah you know just it was nice to um see everyone and 
it's just a great evening overall. And um, I hope you guys liked a lot of the footage. Uh, apologize for the delay in this particular vlog. Um, but I'll be back very soon with another one. It's going to be pretty awesome. we got some cool events coming up. Um, if you haven't already, please go ahead and like and subscribe. Um, big shout out to everyone over at La Santa. Big shout out to Out the House, Two Mex, the legendary Mark Love, A Wall One. It was so cool, man. Um, big shout out to everybody too at the SD State of Mind. Um, you guys know who you are. We were at the Casbah. Uh, it was just such a cool event, man. And um, yeah, please remember to like and subscribe. Um, go ahead and check out Platform Collection, Two Mex TV. We're getting really close to a thousand subscribers. So if you want to head over there and um, Go ahead and like and subscribe over there as well. You know, we're really on it. We're really close to a thousand subscribers over there. So I hope everyone found this one fairly entertaining and informative. And uh, this is Mike Mackey. I hope to see you guys really soon. Peace. I'm used to it.